Over the years, Ukatula has hosted several research projects. Since 2006, more than 13 universities and institutions have done research here at our facility. Over 55 different researchers, postgraduate students and other veterinary professionals have worked at Ukatula gathering information on various projects. I can perhaps mention one very important project that was completed in 2014, which was the genetic study of the white lion, which was published in Nature Communications, and also the tuberculosis research that has been done here at Ukutula. As I mentioned, several publications have resulted from this research. In the last five years or so, um, our facilities and our animals have also been used for reproductive research and some of the research has been published and also used for the benefit of critically endangered cat species elsewhere in the world. Uh, my name is Isabel Callalta and I am a veterinarian from Spain who is currently doing her PhD at the University of Pretoria under the supervision of Professor André Hansbind and Dr. Imke Ludes. And for the last two years, I've been busy studying the reproductive cycle of the African lions, specifically the female African lion. And I'm also trying to develop a protocol for artificial insemination that we can use in this species. And hopefully, we could use this one as a baseline for the other species as well. And right now, we are really excited because we have just had our first successful artificial insemination and and we got two beautiful lion cubs that are the first uh, lion babies that had been born by artificial insemination which is super exciting obviously we still need to work a lot because it, this is just the one and only that we have uh, achieved and and we still need to work on this protocol so so we can have the same result repeatedly, repeated times and, and hopefully it will work and we will be able to apply this knowledge that we are acquiring here and, and we will try to apply this to other felid species that are really endangered and, and threatened at the moment all over the world. <laughs>